Next, I'm going to do the green apples, the Granny Smith apples. I'm going to do half of that, and then I do half and half between the apples and the um, cucumbers. Just go back and forth so the mixture is all to come out nice and more juicy. I don't want anything sticking in. That's why I do the, the, the leafy greens and then I push them out with the, the you get the um the apples or one of the vegetables that, that has more water content in it. Now I'm going to alternate between the apples and this is the cucumbers. Let's start with the cucumbers. Okay. See how fast I'm going? I just love this machine. Back to the apple. Oops. I go back with this and then this is already full I'm probably gonna pour it in something and you're basically done done hi guys all right this is the finished product this is what it looks like well I had I got about 34 ounces from all the fruits and vegetables that I juice so I put some in a cup and this is like a 16 ounce cup so I could I could drink this now and drink drink the rest later but this is so yummy so yummy the combination just like balances everything out the bitterness from the arugula i don't even know how to describe the, the taste of the kale but the 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 um, tartness of the of the granny smith apples and all that water from the for the from the cucumber and the um mexican squash just makes it so 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 delicious try this and let me know how you like it and i'll see you in the next video okay thank you for watching make sure you subscribe like and share my videos all right thank you if you want to see me make something else let me know in the comment and i'll be happy to make it if i can all right thank you so much and have a blessed day